All right, uh, greetings family. This is Bomani Taimba. Welcome to our wonderful, beloved uh, Ghana. And this reminds me of a beautiful home country, Jamaica. So I call Ghana the Jamaica of Africa. And you're on the 13th anniversary journey of a lifetime. And family, this is our 17th journey since uh, 2006. So we appreciate all the wonderful brothers and sisters that have uh, journeyed with us. And we're gonna keep on keeping it strong and keep organizing for us, for the purpose of nation building. Our family, what we did, we gave everybody a tour bag. Mama, can you pull up the tour bag? So family, that, that everyone has a tour bag and in that tour bag is a tour book, a tour t-shirt, postcards and pens all branded Africa for the Africans so those are complimentary materials that uh, we share with all of our tour members and if anyone wants an additional book bag or anything else you can order it on our website and we'll mail it to you especially if your family want a copy one thing I gotta tell you about the tour book make sure you write your name on it and the same thing with the bag that way you can keep up because uh, every all of the brands are all the same so Keep on moving the Sharpies around and put your name on all your document, the documents. Our family, hold on, no time for questions. The solid, let's finish the introduction and then we can talk some more. But what I want everybody to be clear on is the book has your entire schedule. So only thing we're gonna be doing in the morning and the night, when, when we get on the bus and get off the bus, we're gonna go through the schedule for at least one to two days. But it's up to all the individuals to read the schedule, we're going by the exact schedule in the book. So please, when you see me in the morning, don't ask me what we're doing, unless you're asking me a question about what we're doing. Because that means you didn't look over the schedule, and we've been going over the schedule for months, but that is the most important thing about it. any kind of tour that you purchase or you commit to. It's a schedule that you, you know, it's a schedule that you commit to. So this schedule is a serious schedule. There's no days off. If you're tired and don't feel like coming out one night, I'll just recommend this. Enjoy the hotel, uh, their room service, they have a pool, massages, manicure, pedicure, all that good stuff. That's at every hotel we go to. So don't be forced to feel like you just gotta get up and roll with us every day. If that's not what you wanna do, that's fine. So uh, today is Wednesday, December 25th, and we've been traveling for a long time, since yesterday when the journey started, on Tuesday, December 24th. So what I want to do is go over the schedule of what we have. We're going to be at the Micklin Hotel in about 10 to 15 minutes. And once we get to the hotel, we have all your rooms pre-set up and roommates and everything set up. So we get everybody to your room and then you just enjoy a nice, beautiful rest. And for those who are brave enough and can hang, you can come hang out with Bomani Tamba and his crew. If not, we'll see you in the morning. But uh, that's what we do. We do, we run a full schedule. We get up early in the morning and then we up to the night time and we get our rest when the 10 day schedule is over. Uh, so um, we're good. This is, you know, we've been doing this for a long time. Me and my entire crew that you see, all of our wonderful guys uh, from my brother Daniel Yao, Mohammed, Kobla, and Kwabina. And I've known most of these guys since 2006, 2007. So I trust them all my life and I trust them everything we do. And they've been very loyal and respectful and I can't have any issues with any of the things that people normally have an issue with being not trusting people, but this is what you have to do when you come to the motherland. You have to literally find good people and connect with them and build a good relationship because it's all about us working together to build a strong future. Now, when we talk about a schedule, so tomorrow we're going to, we're going up to the mountains. So the goal is for everybody to be ready around eight o'clock and a realistic time to leave is gonna be about 8.30, 9 o'clock. Uh, and what the, the major part of what we have tomorrow is we're going to Tutu, uh, which is up in the mountains, and the school is called Trinity Foundation or Trinity <coughs> Home Academy. Um, those are the different names that we have called, that we have been told over the years. So if you have school supplies, I will say s split it in one third, because we're going to three schools. The other one is One Africa, uh, the, the school, not really a school, but you know, One Africa uh, community, uh, which have a lot of children and also Coma Academy, which are both in Elmina. So just 
bring out a moderate amount of stuff or a decent amount of things and we'll put it together and then we'll collect financial donations for those who want to make it and we'll get it to the school and the other parts of the schedule for tomorrow uh, I'm going to the Avery Botanic Garden and Avery Woodcarving Village and drive to the University of Ghana and we have a wonderful wonderful welcome dinner at the world famous Jam Rock restaurant in East Lagon and I have one that lives right, that's right by my neighborhood in Jonesboro, Georgia mm -hmm. yes um, and but the food here is twice as nice and so once you look at the schedule also you'll see the flow of everything um, and that is Thursday so Friday we're gonna wear the t-shirts we're gonna do our city tour uh, and whenever you're looking at the group pictures you'll see us wearing the t-shirts like and we're taking pictures at Kwame Nkrumah Memorial Park that's usually the first site we go to uh, but we have the schedule flipped around because on Friday we're also doing a repatriation and business conference uh, so the, so after you just enjoy that historical city tour uh, of Kwame Nkrumah Memorial Park W.E.B. Du Bois Memorial George Pradmore Library and the Culture Center we're gonna head back to the hotel and just enjoy a beautiful beautiful dinner and then go to our business conference and for those who are looking to live do business here you definitely want to stay abreast and do a whole lot of networking it's a beautiful two-hour event we're gonna be talking a lot about citizenship and nation building and uh, Saturday family which is our last tour day in our in I guess uh, in Accra we're gonna to go to prom prom and visit the memorial wall and you know, network with some of our brothers and sisters so as you can see, we're in Accra for four days and we have three full tour days so we can enjoy the best of our journey. And family, our brother Kwabna is going to be available to ask him lots of questions about the country and everything. We do real tourism and our goal is to educate our brothers and sisters to the highest level and share all the need to know information. That way others can be clear on what's going on. And so family, once again, appreciate everybody, energy and time and uh, we'll get you checked into the hotel. And if you need any food, you, the restaurant may be closed, but if not, but if it is closed, you can come out to Kiki B's with us and you can order food. And that's in the, that's in the walking distance in the neighborhood. And that's also a wonderful nightclub where we're gonna get ourselves organized for an hour after we get to the hotel. So about 11 o'clock, if you're ready to go out, come holler at us and we'll take you out. So family, once again, this is Bomani Tamba, the tour organizer and tour leader on a journey of a lifetime and I'm just happy to be here for Ghana for the 17th time 13 years strong and we're looking to push another 400 plus brothers and sisters uh, to Ghana and use energy for nation building so another thing I want everybody to know we're going to take everybody to a 23 acre land community which we're going to be doing straight up nation building and we're going to literally just build a community based on what we want uh, there's no dictators in charge or no unorganized person so we have the best of our people working on this project and we're going to deliver it's called a black star repatriation and pan-african community and that's outside of Winneba about two miles away from the beach so we look forward to doing that for you December 29th so now I've gone over a few days of the schedule I'm not expecting you to memorize it but I do expect everyone to take a look at it and be clear on what we're doing so family we'll see you at the hotel in a few minutes and look forward to starting our first tour day tomorrow. All right, so family, appreciate everybody.